Hey guys and welcome back. In this video we shall see how to fix the problem of two finger scroll not working on windows. Now first of all we are going to check whether the two finger scroll is enabled or not from the settings. So just right click on your start button and then click on settings. Then on the left panel you have to click on bluetooth and devices. Then on the right side scroll down till you find touchpad then from here you have to click here on scroll and zoom then coming under here make sure that drag two fingers to scroll is enabled from here make sure there is a tick next to it if this is enabled and still the two finger scroll is not working then you can just right click on your start button then click on task manager after that you have to look for the windows explorer process so you can just click here on name tab so that all the processes are arranged alphabetically and then you can just search for windows explorer it's right here so i'll just close all of them first of all three of them are active and then i'll restart this one all right so now that my explorer has restarted you can check whether the two finger scroll is working or not if still it's not working then you can click on start menu or start button and then search for device manager then open it up now from here i want you to expand mice and other pointing devices then there might be many hid compliant mouse what you can do is you can just right click on any one of them and then click on properties you have to look for something which has the location on i2c hid devices this is the hid compliant mouse which refers to our touchpad if you click on any other one of them like this one is for my keyboard steel series gaming keyboard then the second hid compliant mouse is the usb mouse that is connected to my computer and then this third one is the touchpad so this is the one i2c hid then you click on the driver tab from here and if the rollback driver button is active you can click on that and try to see if the rolling back to previous driver fixes your problem if it has not then you can click on update driver and then search for the drivers on windows update if there is any update available for your driver you can install all of them Once you're done with the updates, make sure that your device is not disabled. It's enabled. If it is enabled, then the disable button will be active. If it is disabled, then there will be a enable button. Then you just click on OK. Restart your computer and check whether it has resolved your problem. If you are still not able to use the two finger scroll, then you can open this device manager once again. Right click on your HID compliant device click on properties make sure it is your touchpad by checking the location it should be i2c hid and then you click on driver tab and this time just click on uninstall device and click on uninstall after you uninstall the device you just have to restart your computer as soon as your computer restarts windows is going to find the latest driver for your touchpad and install it for you I hope that fixes your problem but if still you are having problem with the two finger scroll then the last thing that you can do is open your computer's manufacturer's website and download the drivers which are specifically meant for your computer like for example I am using MSI GL65 Leopard laptop and this is the name of my model so I have written the name of my model space driver and then this is the support page for my laptop in the same way you can find the support and download page for your laptop there you will get tabs for drivers and downloads and from there you will have to look for driver which are meant for your touchpad just the way i can find it out from my laptop then you can install the driver which is available for your laptop by the manufacturer of your laptop and then check if that resolves your problem 
so that's all for this video i hope you were able to resolve your two finger scroll not working problem so don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel i'm going to see you in the next video thanks for watching